To make this shirt and tie, we'll start with the shirt. All you need is a regular piece of copy paper or print paper, eight and a half by 11 inches. And you fold it in half lengthwise and then unfold it and fold the bottom up to that center fold line and the top to that center fold line. Like that. I'm going to turn it upside down and fold these top corners into that center fold line. Like that. Turn it over again. Fold the top corners now instead of to the center fold line to this other fold line and the point goes where those two creases intersect. Like that. Now I'm going to turn it upside down. Makes it easier to fold this bottom edge up right where these edges are at. Like that. And now I'll unfold that and bring in our two sides to the middle and let this open up and these creases I'll reinforce and then I'm going to pull out the sides keep this there so that this bottom edge is even with the top edge and I'm going to make the crease so that I have a diamond shape on this side and a diamond shape on this side Folding these so these two edges are together. Then turn the whole thing upside down and fold down this top edge about over there. Half inch or less. Not more than a half inch. That would be too thick a collar. like that. Now turn it over again and we're going to fold the collar in. Now if you want let me get this shirt here. If you want it to have a tapered waist on the shirt like this then you fold these corners to meet up a little bit higher, about a half inch. I'm saying, or less, less than a half inch. If you want the square, uh, the shirt to just have a square bottom, then you'll have more like uh, almost three quarters of an inch space there. So we'll do this one with a bit of a tapered edge. So I'm going to have this point come up a little bit higher. Like that. Have the point come right to the center. Now this corner needs to meet in exactly the same spot. Right there. Oh, wanted to shift. And then crease that all the way down. 
Now I'll bring up this bottom edge to that same point where our collar meets together and make that crease. And there we have a little tapered edge there and a little tapered edge there. And now just tuck that folded edge underneath the collar. And we have our missionary shirt.